hey guys welcome to another vlog okay ignore these white things on my car because i don't know what the laundry did there but we are going grocery shopping <laughs> again <laughs> you guys can swear for me at this point because i feel like every vlog of mine has a grocery guy i'm vlogging okay i feel like every vlog of mine has this whole grocery shopping clip i'm also tired of it as well let me know if you're tired of seeing it at this point because it's looking like your girl is always buying food <laughs> which is actually the reality anyways i mean are we gonna die of hunger no we're not gonna die so welcome to another vlog if you're new here i'm jane please subscribe to my channel turn on the post notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my videos yeah i'm actually serious about it please subscribe to my channel um i want to go buy a few things by the way new product is launching on my business platform okay new product on gem comida coming um tomorrow i guess i think i'm going to launch it tomorrow so you guys look out for it if you're not following gem comida by now i mean i don't know i just might send you one or two so yeah if you can guess what product it is comment below i know say she goes to my page and go and check it out too comment below and if you get it right then i am going to yeah i'm just going to say you won in my next video or something my next vlog yeah um if you get the product right then you get a pack of that product from me in my next vlog i'll be announcing the winner in my next vlog i guess so yeah let me head out somebody is being impatient and i don't know why bro okay bye guys so i've been wanting to do a kokumi video for a while and i think the last time i did a kokumi video was last year or the year before i don't even remember again but it's been a long long time so i decided to create a filipino curry um recipe video just show you guys how i make mine let me know if you find it interesting and if you want to see more kokumi videos subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed yet and give the video a thumbs up this recipe is the bomb okay it tastes so good i mean my partner even confirms of it he likes it so i'm sure you guys are going to like it as well he even say it tastes better than the one we buy in restaurants so i'm not sure maybe he was just hyping me sure so guys the rest of this video is going to be a voiceover um especially for the cooking aspect because i just want to show you guys how i make my own you know filipino chicken curry and yeah let's just get right into it so basically everybody have their different pattern their own opinion how they do their curry that's your business okay but this is what works for me and my household thank you very much so i start off with seasoning my chicken and my irish potato washed irish potato i start off with onion I put in some stock cube one stock cube because of the size of meat and um you know potatoes that i'm using i added stock cube i added magic syrup if you're familiar with that that's like an all-purpose seasoning here in the philippines 
I also added Italian seasoning, which comprises of rosemary, you know, thyme, basil, and all that, and all purpose seasoning as well. I also went ahead with nutmeg. This just takes your curry to a whole new level. And I added salt to this for taste, obviously, and I did add a bit of water to this. Now, when making curry, you don't need to add so much water because you're going to end up adding cooking cream to it or coconut um, milk, depending on what you prefer to use. But for me, I would always, always opt for coconut milk because of the flavor that it gives. So I bring this to a boil for about 10 minutes and then I set it aside. 10 15 minutes and then I set it aside and then I go ahead to fry my chicken. So for more flavor, I like to put in onion, you know, into the oil and just fry my chicken a little bit just because I don't really like boiled chicken. So frying it just gives it a little bit of hard texture if you ask me. And normally this chicken, I would say use chicken breast, but I didn't have chicken breast. It's more preferable or chicken thighs for this, but I'm using some adobo cuts to make this. Um... Yeah, and then I add my meat stock, I add my Irish potato back to the pot and I now begin to season more. Now I added two tablespoons of curry and um, this is because we are making curry, okay? So you need to taste the curry flavor, alright? So I added um, curry to this, I added coconut milk and, you know, just bring this to a total boil within the space of 10 minutes because you don't want your potato to be extremely soft and you know your veggies and all that so i did add you know this coconut milk and i love this particular brand because it's just the flavor is just everything it just takes your food to the next level guys i'm not gonna lie like coconut milk over cooking cream any day anytime and then i go ahead to add my vegetables which is just carrot and green peas and yeah i just like how i dice them evenly that way your you know your pot is not looking scattered and then i go ahead to pick out a few potatoes that are already done and i begin to mash them a little bit just to get that thickness you know for my curry most people say oh you can use flour to thicken it but i don't like to use flour to thicken mine i actually do prefer using you know the potatoes itself i mean it's just more flavor and then add my special peppers i as i call them green pepper red pepper and add some black pepper to this and it just voila this is all you just get and this tastes so good so good baby so good you have no idea morning guys so this is like a couple of days later guys i haven't really been feeling my best um i've been really 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 ill i don't know i've been guys my body is just acting really weird i try to like oh say i'll film today i'll end up not filming and i just have so many things really that's just bugging me disturbing me i don't know anyways i'm trying to edit a video that i filmed but it's not i'm not in that mood so i am trying to watch a youtube video i'm going to quickly show you guys that i'm trying to watch a youtube video just to you know just set my brain probably i guess and just put me in the mood to edit this video maybe maybe not but yeah, let me quickly show you guys who I'm watching. One of my faves actually. Um, this is called Baby Girl Toast. Let me show you guys. So this is really good for me because I know I can't just pretend that girl So this is her channel. How it works. This is so Hey guys, good morning. I know I look a bit crusty. Anyways, I'm not just waking up. I woke up before and I went back to sleep again. But yeah, quick update. Quick one, quick one. Your girl is now detoxing. Okay, I'm supposed to add cucumber to this, but there's no cucumber. So I sent baby boy to help us out with cucumber. So guys, I went to the hospital the other day and I climbed the scale. Hey <laughs> god. It wasn't looking good, okay. And I noticed I've added a lot of weight, like I now have double chin, you guys. I'm so 
now like so big i don't even know how i got to this stage yesterday i was looking at myself in the bathroom i was like how 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 did how did we get here but i think it also it's also about the whole lockdown thing we don't go out often you can't walk around i don't even exercise guys i'm not an exercising person so i'm back to trying to detox get into it um and that thing is my boyfriend doesn't help matters okay <laughs> let me tell you people he doesn't help matters because he likes food I like food so even if i don't want to eat he would want to eat so it's like <laughs> anyways yeah back to the toxin and um he also bought a few groceries i want to show you guys guys it's been so hard vlogging because of you know we don't have anywhere to go to basically and i took out my over a month corn roll my hair is smelling so bad i'm going to take care of that today ah yeah but before that let's make breakfast let's you know do one or two things with our lives <sighs> i'm so exhausted i'm even out of breath talking that's how much we have added i mean some fruits to help our ministry um grapes I'm trying to remember the names of this thing. Sorry, this is banana. Mm. This has ripe, but this is the type he likes to buy every time. First in my life, cucumber. Babe, why did you buy just one? Some apples. Oh my god, you bought a lot of apples. Oh, a lot. Red apple in particular, that's the type I actually like. I feel like that's one that is more tasty and juicy. Um, avocado pear, guys. See, let me tell you something with me at avocado lately. I've been craving, I crave avocado every time. And now I'm beginning, you know, the way they say pregnant women to crave things. <laughs> that's the way I be craving this thing. Like, if I've not eaten it, Aha nezumike, meaning my body doesn't rest if I don't eat it. So I also got apple cider vinegar because see we have started drinking this thing every night so that in the morning after me gonna get flat. Let's see how long me and this my detox journey is gonna go because if you know me, I don't to last more than one month or two months doing this and yeah more drinks babe why will you buy fruit drink and still buy um why will you buy apples and still buy apple drink again like it's just the same taste over and over again should i just bought another flavor um jesus is lord babe are you sure this milk is still good it's half it's so half it's half guys and yeah pick me no now did we just drink pick me this two months ago <laughs> anyway so yeah picnic and some pap this is like blended corn you're going to see me make it i'm going to show you guys how i make it because i'm about to make breakfast so yeah i need to quickly meet this before this boy puts copyright in this video bye
so guys just in case you want to learn how to make this corn pudding also known as akamu pap this is usually is a regular breakfast in nigeria and we have it with fried plantain fried potatoes you know bread whatever and this is just how we make it basically it's already prepared um i don't know how they make this but somehow they make it work so basically they just add water to it and you begin to break it gradually until it becomes into liquid form to a certain you know um consistency or texture till it's like this before you can now add your boiled water to it and basically guys this can easily flop just like me just like mine did because when i made this it flopped it, it didn't tick in and most of the time that's how some of the um corn puddings we buy here turn out because it's not really made the way they make it back home so it always flops anyways most of the time so in order to correct this all you need to do is just pour it into a pot and you know stir it gradually until it thickens up so yeah this tasted really really good just in case you try out any of the recipes in this video feel free to tag me on instagram follow me on instagram as well at dima jane subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed thumbs up this video share this video and i'll see you guys in my next one love you guys eat good food and be happy bye